Welcome back to the Bearhawk build. The car is leaking coolant again, and so it's out of the garage heating up. I'm gonna run some diagnostics codes. And the last video I said I was done with the prep, but I'm not. I forgot to drill the little slot for the wing attachment bracket, strut attachment bracket to go through. So that's what we need to do today. Um, clamped it up lining everything up gonna mark off the initial um, cuts that'll go in here with the Dremel and then I'll have to drill through that hole as well so that's on the agenda today and then we'll probably get to some painting as well don't know if we'll get all the painting done though so I marked the rough cut right there with a the sharpie I'm probably going to just you know slice through that measure it on this side trans transfer it over to here and do a rough cut and then just start expanding the hole until uh, or the slot until it starts to fit these pieces so I think I've got a couple Dremel bites Dremel bits thin cut metal and I probably blow through these a lot today and it should be a pretty straightforward operation got the cap strips on everything's lined up um, that's marked let me transfer that and get going don't forget to wear your breathing protection your eye protection your hearing protection and the safest you can be is to like and subscribe. See what I did there? Okay, so rubbing a little bit down here. Got some trimming to do. I'll probably do that with a file. Round those edges off like that. Gotta just trim the bottom here. And then drill through the cap strip. Good gap on both sides and underneath. Gonna clean that up and then we'll start drilling. I got a lunch plans, so we'll see you after lunch. We're back, so I'm going to uh, use my quarter inch drill bits as um, markers to keep everything lined up and then drill that hole and then this hole through the cap strips to right here. So I gotta line up the cap strip items, clamp them together, and then um, we're good to go. So I've uh, lined up and clamped the wing support strut or the wing strut brackets. So they're all ready for drilling. I'm gonna drill that hole and that hole.
brackets are done. All right, let's uh, get this stuff painted, which will be tomorrow for me, but a couple seconds for you. Woo, welcome back, sweaty. It's kind of warm, also kind of cold. Got ice on the ground. Anyway, uh, gonna start painting the left wing spars. Again, we're just going to be using the good old Rust-Oleum primer and folding tables. So it's about 50 degrees out, snow's melting slowly, warm enough to paint. So I'm gonna film like the first couple passes and then just cut to the next piece when everything's done because painting's kind of boring. Comment below if uh, you want to see painting because I personally don't think it's entertaining, but you know, there are people out there that enjoy it. First part of the spar is done. Now for a bunch more. More is done. Cap strips are done. Sp uh, spars are done. And uh, the brackets are done. So let's get to riveting. All right, we're on the ceiling because we're gonna start riveting, taking the stuff down. Car's out of the garage and we're just gonna rivet on the ground like I did the last time. You know the drill? We're gonna do a little bit of a riveting montage, so enjoy. work on this video. Just checked over my work. I'm like the first one. I learned from my mistakes and I have perfect rivets. Well, say perfect. No smiley faces, which is a big win. That's about it for this one. Um, thanks for watching. I'll try and keep content consistent, but we are going to be moving in a couple weeks. So uh, if there's a pause in the plane stuff, don't worry, it'll be back, and hopefully there will be 
other content that you guys can watch. So make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.